We're looking at page 98, exercise 7. We're looking at items 1 to 3. We have a table here, and it says that we left Jamaica at 8.45 a.m., and we're supposed to arrive in Nassau at 10.25 a.m. How much time did that take? So, quite simply, we would subtract to find the difference. So, 10.45, and we're going to take away um, 8.45. So, 5 from 5 would leave 0. Um, 4 from 4 would leave 0. And 8 from 10 would leave 2. So, that would be a total time of 2 hours. So, our answer for number 1 would be 2 hours. Let's look at um, item 2. Puerto Rico. Departure from Puerto Rico would have been 9.55. Our arrival is unknown, but in Antigua, um, it took us one hour to get to Antigua. So, let's look at what we would do there. We would have to add an hour to our departure to get our total travel time. So, here we have an hour, and we would say 0 plus 5, 5, 0 plus 5, 5, and 9 and 1 would give us 10. So our answer would be 10.55. Looking at item 3 for Barbados, um, we don't know our departure time just yet. We know our arrival in Port-au-Prince, port of spain rather, not Port-au-Prince, is 6.55 with a total time of 5 hours. So we would need to subtract in order to, to find when we would have um, left or our departure time. So we have 6.55 and we're going to take 5 hours from that and we say 0 from 5 would give us 5 here, 5 there and 5 from 6 would give us 1. So our answer would be 1 hour and 55 minutes. So from these examples you should be able to work out Grenada and Cuba.